Good evening, everybody, and welcome back to another edition of Dad Time Gaming on the Gaming Source Network, your number one source for all things gaming. Tonight, I wasn't planning on going live, and if I did, I was going to play Mafia, um, but uh, tonight, we're doing something special. Um, earlier today, I was at, board, uh, at work, I was bored, I saw this tweet from e AT&T, and it was weird. You know, I said, play Batman, you know, play Batman now, Bla Batman Arkham Knight, and I was like, wait, I don't get it. And then, you know, no downloads necessary on Chrome. I said, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait, what's going on here? Clicked on the link. It wouldn't let me play it from my phone. Um, but uh, but I was like, and then, you know, one thing led to another. Then I remembered that, you know, AT&T had that Stadia um, promo going on. Um, AT&T, I believe they own Warner Brothers or there's some, there's some kind of tie there. Um, but uh, it just kind of all sunk in i'm like oh this has to be the white labeling that people are talking about um <laughs> sad dude Sa, boricua x play que hace, que la que. Uh, <laughs> so um yeah you know it was it was cool so i was like oh this has to be an extension of stadia uh so tonight that's what i'm going to try out um let's go ahead and set this up hold on all right i can go ahead and Pull my YouTube back up just to make sure that's running properly. All right. So, uh, as you can see here, it's basically, you know, we're on a web browser. Um, I have my Xbox uh, One controller connected to it um, just because it's Bluetooth connected to the to my to my Mac. Uh, so that should be the easiest way to do it. I don't know. We'll see. Um, I haven't tested like what controllers work or anything. So this is the first time that we're trying this um blah blah, blah blah okay okay just hit continue all right so it's just giving you a little warning i'm gonna go through and press buttons um and see if there's uh if there's any kind of menu to this um we need somebody like gem stadia to pick it up or gem excuse me um to pick it up and see if he can crack something and try to figure out a little bit more it's kind of weird <laughs> 
Jeff Carey, have you tried? Oh, have I tried Stadia before? Uh, yeah, <laughs> I have. Uh, I love it. Um, actually, it may. Hold on, let me, let me continue. There we go. Uh, I am a pro member uh, and a founder. Vet Cloud Gaming, my dog. What's good, man? You excited for uh, some GeForce news tomorrow? GeForce Now news tomorrow? It's going to be fun. <laughs> Clearly, yes. I'm going to press all the buttons. Avery, I love you. How you doing? I'm going to be pressing all the buttons. I'm going to see if we can get into something. Uh, let me know if the game audio is too low or if my, mouth, my mic is too loud. Uh, let's check this out. Samu Garcia. Welcome. Welcome to the Gaming Source Network, your number one source for all things gaming. Up, up, down, down. <laughs> oh, are we going to play the... Uh, are you going to go ahead and uh, 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 do the uh, the Konami code? Get unlimited batarangs? All right, first and foremost, I'm going to tell you, it feels, I mean, we're just here at the main menu, but it feels really good. It looks really good. Um, I mean, I saw a tweet earlier from MM2K. I'm going to put it on easy. Um, uh, we'll turn subtitles on and continue. Uh, I'm I'm gonna go ahead and say M A Two K when he uh, he tweeted earlier that you know this is running on Stadia Tech running better than Stadia. <laughs> we're gonna we're gonna find out tonight. <laughs> Hold on, let me pull this up real quick. Uh, okay, you guys are all chatting with each other. Hope white labeled games also come to the Stadia storefront. I do too. I do. I really do as well. Um, you know, at least let's say they do this promotion where they give this game to at&t to 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 let the subscribers play for free um that's cool then throw it on the stadia store for like 10 bucks or something like i mean but again we don't know what the back end deals are happening maybe it's you know maybe it's it can only be on um on at&t's cloud gaming service they need to name it something uh jeff Carey, are so confused is this gfn or stadia tech uh this is actually running off of google cloud game services stadia uh but um i'm not gonna lie to you it's so for each different um you know console or, or service i i i always name it something stupid whatever they have a hiccup you know you have the stadia stutter you have the geforce now glitch um the xbox i don't even know what i call the x cloud <laughs> but uh right now this is running beautifully oh yeah uh, avery thank you very much for saying that this is if you have not played the other games um yeah this is a big spoiler with that being said this game did come out uh seven years ago <laughs> Yeah, uh, Kagura leader, uh, you are correct. I do hope something comes up next week in the, um, let's go ahead and get this. I have not played this game since the, um, I played it on PS4. All right, see you later, Joker. Um, I played it, I played it at launch on PS4, uh, and I, I like this game. So, so far, uh, visually, it looks beautiful. The buttons feel really good. Um, I mean, it, I, I haven't felt any, any sort of input lag at all. But we haven't started playing yet. But just by going through the menu, um, just by going through the menu, it felt, it felt really responsive. All right, I'm holding the. Um, uh, Kagura, it feels, uh, it feels, it feels dirty. It feels, it definitely feels dirty. And I'm not. Uh, oh, yeah, it's it's a little choppy. Well, I mean, 
when I say choppy, I don't mean in in that way. It, it feels like it's running at thirty. Oh, that was a little bit of a a little stutter there. Uh, yeah, you know what? I I can't wait to see. I mean, the possibilities. This was a complete surprise today. Um, I mean, to my knowledge, I wasn't expecting anything. All right, so. Yeah, it pretty much does feel like. Uh... All right, cool. Okay, so right now, if you notice, my camera's going up like crazy. There was a little bit of input lag there. Yeah, when it, when it, okay, all right, there we go. So look, look, I'm not, I'm not touching anything and it's going, it's going by, by itself. So it is a little funky, but I am, I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm working off of Bluetooth right now. So let me confront this dude. Battlefield on AT&T would be great. <laughs> I'm so bad at Battlefield. Um, I do use Stadia often through browser. Um, and like I said, honestly, it's it does feel like it's running better. Um, however, I'm going to have to run this a second time. Uh, because I actually play Stadia on the um, Edge browser. Oh, let me shoot these. Let me shoot. Let me do this up real quick. Nope. Come on, bro. Get off me. But yeah, I, I've I've seen less glitches on this than on Stadia. To be honest with you. Just want to get into the gameplay now. The one thing I'm not looking forward to is the bat, uh, bat tank missions. The bat tank missions in this game suck. Yeah, I'm uh I'm definitely pleasantly surprised at how well this is running. Coincidence, I'm thinking you were only in a few minutes. Yeah, this is this is nice. <laughs> What's up, Dr. Spaceman? Game looking good on the land of AT. It's Dr. Spaceman, it is looking good. Uh, I'm not going to lie. It, it definitely is looking good. Um, I haven't gotten into pure gameplay yet, but as far as visuals and smoothness, it looks... I mean, if they ported it over, I really hope one day... Because, I mean, there's a lot of I mean, uh, a lot of people that aren't AT&T subscribers. They're not going to be able to play this in the cloud. Um, I think eventually they should. That should be part of the model. If they're going to be doing these... Uh, if they're going to be doing these special contracts with these uh, with these mobile subscribers or cable subscribers or what have you, um, they should take that game that they're giving away for free on AT and T service. They're not giving away, but allowing us to play. And um, and and shit, they've already ported it to to Linux. Throw it on Stadia for ten bucks. Yeah, this is this is running really well though. Thank you everybody uh, uh everybody who showed up today. Thank you. I really do appreciate that. Um my name is F Tendo. This is Dad Time Gaming on the Gaming Source Network, your number one source for all things gaming. 
We have some cool ass people in here. Vet Cloud Gaming, Dr. Spaceman, Maker of Chaos. What's good? My man Jeff Carrier. Avery, where are you? Ninja Guy X, what's up? Okay. All right. So just moving the camera, this feels this feels awesome. Um I played this game on PS4 when it first came out. And this is really nice. So let's go fly. This poor job is not cheap. Nope. All right, and dive bomb. Okay, I got to remember how to fight. I don't remember how to fight. Nope, nope, oh, 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 bro, what are you doing? All right, so we got Y for counter. All right, I got to I got to try to remember all this stuff. Okay, uh Oh, shit. <laughs> I forgot to press the button. <laughs> forgot to press the button. Bang! All right, so where do we go, Bats? Nope, nope, nope. How do you run in this game? I forgot how to run. Oh, there we go. Hold that. We'll go take the skies. Let's go take to the skies. All right. Okay, we're going over here. Where's they at? They still want to fight me? <laughs> Do they still want to fight me? Are we almost here? Uh, yes, Jedi Jedi Fallen Over Order level of quality. Yes, Madden Twenty One. I would I would argue that that was a really good port as well on uh on Stadia. Oh, look at that! <laughs> All right, let's get into some action. Are uh, we entering here? Is that what we're doing? No, 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 no. Let go. Stop. I think we have to go up, right? Yeah, I think I have to go up. Oh yeah. Nomad streams, uh it is really good. It is really good for uh for whatever it is. You know, they're saying it's running off of Google. So we can only assume that it's Stadia Tech. Um it looks good, it feels good. This is pretty crazy. I don't know. What does everybody think should be the next game? I mean, is this only a contract with WB? I'd like to see Injustice 2 in the cloud. Like a non input laggy. <laughs> Cause I mean it's on X Cloud, but it's just it just has a slight lag to it on X Cloud. Um no, nothing. There's like no real menu, uh, Dr. Spaceman. There's nowhere to back up into except for exiting the game. Um, like I was saying earlier, we need somebody like Jem to get in here. Cause I think Jem will, will, will break it down and find a little, you know, the little hidden nuances in the code. Um, but, uh, but, but 
Yeah, Mortal Kombat would be nice. Mortal Kombat crossplay too, because Stadia got screwed out of that one. We got Mortal Kombat 11, but Xbox and PlayStation got crossplay. There we go. There's a little glitch right there for you guys. That's the second one that I've uh, discovered. Let's look at let's look at bats real good. Okay, so there we go. Okay, so where are we going now? Rescue the missing police officer. So we got 538 meters. What are you doing? Might be a weirdo. Uh, gliding is still a little weird though in this game. Ooh, the Harry Potter game would be, would be something else. That's actually, oh man. And that's something AT&T would do. <laughs> AT&T would like straight up just say, hey, let's get that just on AT&T. <laughs> All right, so I forget how to be really, uh, let's see. Uh, okay, so we got drop kick. Oh, come on. I pressed the button. Bam. Oh, I keep pressing the wrong button. It's LT. There we go. Got him. Got him. Two weeks early access over the rest. <laughs> Dude, that would drive people crazy. If, if AT&T Cloud Gaming, whatever the hell this is called, gets their Harry Potter exclusivity rights for two weeks prior to release, I think people will lose their crap. Um, yeah, so I did press the middle button. Um, the middle button just brings you this menu that says use your keyboard to open the menu. So let's let's try that out. Let's pause this real quick. Give a shift and escape. So there you go. That's the menu. Um, if you notice, it came from the right, just like Stadia. You got the exit and the hold, just like Stadia. I mean, this is Stadia, guys. This this is this is Stadia. Look at this. It's got all the menus, everything. It's just minus the color. I mean, it's got a freaking Stadia controller here in the menu. <laughs> this is a Stadia. That's crazy. It's nice to see the proof right here. So if everybody wants to get, take a quick look, you got a Stadia controller right here in the middle. Um, this is the main menu. The main menu rolls open just like Stadia. Um, yeah. Yeah. White Stadia menu. Exactly. All right, well, now that we got that settled, let's get back into the game. It's legitimately a white label. <laughs> it's a white labeled Stadia. All right, let's go even the odds. Oh, am I going to get the... Uh, is this bat tank mode? Oh, no. Oh, no. The first time I played this game, I think it took me an entire day. White for the white label. <laughs> well, that's good to know. You know what's kind of crappy, though? Like, they should have just went all in and let you wirelessly connect to the Stadia controller as well. I got Wasabi chilling right here, but I don't have a USB-C uh, cable to, 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 to plug it into my computer. All right, so in this faster pace, it's still running really well. All 
I'm coming, I'm coming. Oh, oh, that's a glitch. That is a glitch. Whoop. Come on, bro. Ooh, got him. All right, let's go ahead and exit the Batmobile. Um. Uh, can you run run toward him? What's your name? <laughs> oh man, he tried. All right, now that we got the whole stadium thing to the side, anybody excited for the Batman movie? Robert Pattinson playing Batman? I'm not going to lie to you. Me? That trailer was fire. <laughs> Best joke I heard, I believe, from... Hold on. Locked in a room to get out. <laughs> yeah, I'm not going to lie to you, man. I, Dr. Spaceman, I never have an issue with pairing. Um, and, and I've never had a disconnect from, like, all... You know, I go through Google or Google, I go through Twitter and I see that there's a lot of people having issues with sound um, and disconnect issues with the controller. Um, I don't know. I have the, I have the habit of actually resetting um, my Chromecast, my Google uh, TV with Chromecast. Uh, we reset it every night. Um, so I never have issues uh, with Stadia running on the Google Chromecast. To be honest, though, I don't play it as much there. The most that I play uh, Stadia is on my iPhone with a backbone um, or when I'm streaming. But I rarely use my Chromecast or my Google TV with Chromecast. <clears throat> and yes, that movie does keep getting better and better looking. I'm really excited for that movie. Oh, we got to. Oh, what happened? All right, so. All right, so right now I have some weird. Okay, I'm I'm back. All right, so since this is the place, we're going to the penthouse. How do I get in? How do I get in? All right, here we go. Shh. Oh, how did they see me? There we go. Uh, it could be the area code area located issue where the code doesn't go through. Oh, shit. <laughs> Oh, I, I forgot the button. Um, uh, this is not the actual game, is it? Cloud gaming, it is. It's the actual game. Um, it's, it's the game. <laughs> it's pretty crazy. And then we actually pretty figured out it's, it's, uh, oh, we've, we figured out it's definitely Stadia, um, that it's running off of. Um, and, you know, MM2K tweeted earlier that it feels like it's running better than Stadia, and he's he wasn't lying. Okay, where the hell is this? Where am I going? Where am I going? I gotta. What's what's going? What, what's going on? Yeah. Uh, bump, bump, bump. It said penthouse. Ah, there we go. There we go. Open the door, Batman. Come on. Are you kidding me? Freaking Batman. <laughs> How are you running it? Uh, Chrome. Or, um, 
yeah, Google Chrome um, and Xbox One controller on an M1 Mac. Oh, here we go. Oh, no, it's climbing. Ah, uh -huh. all right. See right there. That's so, so far, um, this is the third, uh, like glitch that I've had. Um, uh, let me fight these guys. Boom. Good night, buddy. Love you. It's inappropriate. Yes, it is. Thanks. Good night. I love you. Okay, go. Good night, buddy. Through, uh, yes, through AT and T. Good night, puppy. Though I love you. If Bro was sleeping in here. He just got I know, I know. Oh, okay. Come on, I, I, I gotta go. And you're like, <laughs> Alright, love you. And Out. Okay, love, love you guys. Sweet dreams. Alright, let's get back into this. Uh, Alright. So, yeah, this is running through AT&T. Um... But uh, like I said earlier, I'm not sure if you were in here earlier, Cloud Gaming Stream. But um, so if you hold that, basically on the right, that's the Stadia menu. Um, you have your Wi-Fi test, your controller setup with an image of a Stadia controller, um, and then your power and exit. Um, not really much else. There's no no other options. It's pretty bare bones. I mean, it's definitely the it even has the same notification down here about pairing PlayStation and Xbox Bluetooth controller. It's the same, same exact thing. Um, I, I, I love the M1, but um, it's the MacBook Air M1. I love it. Um, I had to do a little bit, you know, a few things to make it work uh, for me, but it does exactly what I need. You know, I'm running OBS and a browser-based video game. Ray, my dude, what's up, bud? Welcome. I'm playing Batman on AT and T. The new yo, this is the new streaming service. AT and T, let's go. <laughs> Minus the whole OAN and their shitty uh, uh, sp sponsorships. But yeah, this is um. Uh, this is sick. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to reiterate what I said before. I really, really, really do hope that in the future, if they continue, if they continue to do things like this, continue to do um, promotions where there's, you know, white labeling a specific game to a specific service like HBO Max next month will give us, you know, something else and uh, Verizon will give us something else. That's cool if they're gonna if they're gonna give these uh, extra perks to their specific customers. That's cool. That's awesome. But if it's already ported to Linux, throw it on Stadia for a couple bucks. Throw throw it on there. After new AT and T sponsors, <laughs> I'm changing my name. I'm changing my name to F at <laughs> F A T and T something. I don't know. Ray, you got AT and T? Get out of here, bro. You already got, you already got the Luna emoji, man. Luna hooked you up. Stop trying to take it all. I want an AT and T logo. <laughs> Check it in Cam Live. Cam Live. It's fully option uh, optimized for the M1 processor. It's the only one. Oh. Thank you. Hold on. Let me take a screenshot. Thank you. Let's when Guardian Leviosa the hell out of the street. <laughs> Mr. Perfect, I bet the new Batman is coming to the cloud. Um, hey, we can only hope, man. I want uh, 
that's one thing with me. I mean, if whoever knows me, like, I love video games. I don't give a shit where you play them at. I don't, I don't care where they're available, um, as long as they're available. And me personally, I want everything to come to the cloud, especially, especially Stadia. I'm, I love Stadia. Uh, select Batmobile remote. Okay, mobile remote. Okay, mobile remote. Okay, mobile remote. Okay. I'm gonna release. Batmobile is gonna show up and murder some people. Harry Potter would be sick. Um, Harry Potter might get my wife into gaming. <laughs> Batman murdering people. All right, so we hold LT to battle mode. That's just that's that bank or the uh, tank mode. I think we are starting to see AT and T's new gaming service. I mean, if this is it, this is, I mean, this is. This is Stadia. Okay, where are we doing? What are we doing? What, are, what am I doing? Oh, we gotta shoot these guys? Oh. Oh, what the hell? We gotta, we gotta battle these guys. Oop, back up. Nah, bro. He said target locked. He said target locked like they meant it. Let's get this one more. Got him. All right, that's good. Yeah, yeah I can see. I mean, all, that's a Warner Brothers has a huge catalog of games from old from old to new. As an AT and T uh, um, customer that loves cloud gaming, you shit, you you got me. I can see, yeah, definitely. Oh, Doctor Sp uh, Doctor Spaceman, you out? Have a good night, man. I I, uh, I missed I missed saying bye to him. My fault. All right, uh, where are we going to go? Where are we going to go? All right, we're going this way. <laughs> Wait, I don't think I was supposed to get out of the car. Hold on. I judge. I got excited. I was having too much fun. Wait, oh. I always think games are Grand Theft Auto. Wait, what am I supposed to do? I'm lost. Wait, what, what the hell? <laughs> Rear reverse. Okay, so we're going to do that. <laughs> oh, don't. This guy's annoying. Hold on, hold on. Uh, ah. Okay, there we go. Let's get back into the car. Let's get back into the car. How did I change that view? Okay, here we go. Yo, this is driving me crazy. Okay, uh, unleash the Batmobile's awesome power. Destroy enemy targets while avoiding. No, I don't want to do challenges. I just want to play the game. There we go. Oh. No, I went too far. Oh, okay. Am I going this way? All right, I'm going this way then. I got sidetracked looking at chat. There we go. Now I'm headed to the right. No, it put me right there. Oh, I guess I got to do this stupid challenge. I guess I got to do this challenge. I was trying to get out of that. 
Uh, Dogman420, no one did. <laughs> no one knew at t had a service. Or, uh, at least I didn't know. I can't speak for everyone. But, um, yeah, this is pretty cool. Okay, so what are we supposed to do? So occasionally you do have uh, the little hiccups. I got to find a name for it. I mean, technically it's Stadia, so I can call it Stadia Stutter. But um, this is a this is a different service. I gotta I gotta find a different name for it. Okay, missile barrage one. All right, so we got X. Oh, okay. So we gotta hold it. I mean, I'm doing, I'm doing what it's asking me. Do I gotta stay in the middle? I hate the Batman or the Batmobile missions. Okay, I guess I got to keep on destroying these things. So you just got to, um, you have to have AT&T service. So when you go to the website, it's like att.com uh, slash play Batman or something like that. Um, once you do that, um, it asks for your phone number. And your zip code. Once you do that, then you're good. All right, cool. Uh, is there a contract where the game AT&T gets Stadia? Also, get Stadia could get games without even trying. Sir, yo, Nomad. I mean, they ported it to Stadia, so it only makes sense um, that they dropped that. Taking damage depletes your weapon energy. Okay. All right. So. I gotta let them not hit me, right? Whoop. He tried. I got the dodge game on point. Ooh, I missed him though. All right. All right. I got this. Okay. Get out of get out of these stupid ass Batman challenges. There's another stadium stutter. Uh wow, that is nice things. Uh, I have Spectrum as my phone and internet and I'm just <laughs> Yeah, it's pretty, it's pretty cool, man. It's, I hope they do something with this. All right, where are we going next? There we go. Whoop. <laughs> Bad driver. Okay. go oh there we go get away from me I'm shooting All right, here we go that's close that was close. Oh, there's somebody behind me. Oh, 
Where we at? Where we at? Uh, by the same token, hold on, I want to read that. Uh, by the same token, AT&T and any other company might want to white label services because they bought full control over the games. Uh, it's it's true, and that's a that's a negative and a positive. Um, I think it's more of a. Ah, uh, uh, look at this. That was a bad glitch. Um, I think if it's, I think it's a negative if they gatekeep it, like, like we were just talking about earlier, it'd be really cool if they had uh the Harry Potter game came over. Um, if they gatekeep it, it's gonna suck. But uh, if if Google signed a way to actually said yeah cool you can have it in your service and you can sell it on our service um that would be pretty cool i think that'd be a win-win for everybody yeah <laughs> Uh, I think we will see more companies use white limiting to offer games to their users. I think so too. I think this is the start of something. I think this is the start of something. What? We don't know. Oop. <laughs> it's the tank. I think they will gatekeep it to their users yeah and that's that's when it's gonna suck um if they make it just for their their, their users after it's already ported to stadia like google google has to be smarter than that right <laughs> google has to be smarter than that and be like yeah yeah sure no problem you can have it on your at&t service but it's ported it's ported to linux already it's playing throw it on stadia Yep. Yeah. Uh, cloud gaming stream. Are you are you guys not hearing any sound? I'm sorry. Oh man, I've been playing this whole game on silent. Come on. <laughs> Hold on. Oh man, I feel like an asshole. Guys, I really apologize. There we go. Oh God. <laughs> 10 points for CGX, man. Damn. I've been over here playing this on silent. You guys are just hearing me talk and breathe on the mic like an animal. <laughs> Alright, so there's a uh, sound. Like, like, that was a, all right, that was a little bit of a funky glitch. All right, where are we going now? <laughs> I thought the silence was by design. No, it definitely wasn't, man. <laughs> it was by, uh, by neglect. All right, where are we going? Where am I supposed to go? All right. These ain't the usual weapons we find on Gotham low life. These ain't the usual low lives neither. <laughs> Damn, why does he gotta call him a low life though? <laughs> the gaming advocate. My brother. How you doing, man? You just missed it. You just missed the whole thing. We've gone I've been playing now for um forty nine minutes on silence. <laughs> I mean everybody can hear me talking, but not the game. Oh, can I not? Okay, there we go. All right, we're going through the evidence room. Checking this all out. A collection of body parts belonging to Warren White. One for you and one for you. That's cool. All right, out of it. Oh, look at that. Give me that. This guy just break his shit in the, <laughs> break his stuff in the, uh, in the police department. The thing that stands out to me is that this is AT&T. Instead of a more global brand like Warner, uh, of Warner, 
How likely is it that AT&T will have a streaming service outside of America? Um, no, yeah, I, I agree with you. I don't know what ties they have outside. I know before AT&T, wasn't it Vodafone um, overseas that had a contract? There was another company, but outside of the United States that had a contract with Google. Um, I could see other companies signing small contracts with different game developers uh, to bring specific IP to, let's say, Verizon, you know, Verizon wireless cloud gaming. You can play all of uh, the old uh, take two games or something, you know, I can see that happening. But yeah, it might be that specific uh, specific IP doesn't make it um, out of their their regions due to contracts. They can, but the brand is kind of meaningless beyond America. Yeah. All right, so let's go out here. Yeah, it was me. <laughs> I broke it. I've got a solution. You just don't seem to want to hear it. Uh, let's let's chill with Gordon. Screw you. Damn bureaucrats. We're on our own. We can handle it, Jim. What's the latest? We've got So it's pretty cool. We discovered a lot here tonight. Hey, uh Give us a rundown. All right, let's see. That's true, yeah. First up, we've lost contact with the fire crew from station 17. We've got their last known coordinates, but they're not going to survive out there. We're going to do uh, about one more mission. Then there's this. And I'm going to call it. A stranger. His body turns up. He didn't have long to look before the evacuation, but the forensic boys seem freaked out. Real nasty. Also, we've had several sightings of the Riddler creeping around the train yard. Knowing that guy, he's got to be... What did, who did the voice for the Commissioner Gordon? He sounds good. Look, I know you're busy. Anything you can do to help is going to save lives. It's, worry, this man. camera is so wonky. Look at this. Scarecrow. Like I stop pressing and it just keeps going. <laughs> I've got a skeleton crew searching. All right, now it's better. I'm gonna join him when I'm done here. We're gonna find that son of a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> okay, use the mission select screen to select your next target in Gotham City. When locating a new supervillain or mission. They will be automatically added to the screen. Select the icon if you want to return to hunting down Scarecrow. Cool. Oh, we got expansion missions. So this is pretty much like the complete edition. Yeah, this is... This is pretty, pretty, pretty cool. Fernandez, I'll look into these later. Scarecrow's the priority. Good luck out there, Batman. Thanks, man. Thanks a lot. All right, let's go. Let's talk to her. Let's talk to her. Uh, Performance-wise, it's it's Stadia. It's it's running almost identical to Stadia. Uh, if not, a little better, but that's probably because it's just like one server blade housing one game um, as opposed to, you know, what do we have, 100 and change now? But yeah, it performs well. Visually, it looks great. I have had I have had hiccups, but then again, I'm streaming a game uh, and streaming. <laughs> Plus, my wife is probably watch something, watching something downstairs. Uh, my kids are probably listening to their Alexas. That guy, that guy's pissed. All right. Let's get back in our car. It's out here, right? Yeah. Get back into Batmobile. Air support car turned into some kind of tank. Nice. <laughs> they all got busted. Additional expansion missions are now available. You can toggle between. Okay, so we're not going to do any of that. Don't get too close. Yeah, back up. All right, hold on. So that goes into detective mode or bat mode, whatever it's called. Okay, the left is the AR challenges. We're not going to do that. Down can change the weapon. And right goes into overall progress and all that good stuff. Um, I think it's 1080. I think it's 1080. 
Uh, but I, I, I have, um, I don't have anything special. I got a, a regular old monitor. I, I run everything at 1080 anyways, since I'm streaming. Since I'm streaming a stream, I, I don't want to use 4K um, and waste the bandwidth. Not waste it, but hog it up and mess up my stream. There you go. There's, there's a glitch right there. All right, so. I keep one. I got to change the buttons to this. Nope, can't go that way. Yeah, what's it? Oh, 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 something's going on down here. Oh, no, that's just the, uh... Alright, that was dramatic. Can you give me a mission? the missions at where are the missions at overall progress let's see all right here we go i want to do i want to do one more mission before i end the stream Oh, no, no, no. So I don't want to do that one. That's the one we did earlier. I'm heading to the clock tower. Okay, there we go. There we go. I forgot how good this game was. I thought there was a way to uh, let's go up let's go up top right in progress there we go <laughs> I walked right over it and I pressed the button and it, it, I did it wrong all right, so let's toggle detective mode. Let's go grab some stuff. Hello, Bruce. Hello, Bruce. Oh, it looks like my camera's all jacked up in here too. You've managed to reduce the compound to its core elements. But there's nothing in there that we can trace. What if we've been looking at this the wrong way? Instead of searching for the toxin, what if we focus on the manufacturing process? Phytomycin. The reaction emits a unique radiation spike. Run a scan of the city for this energy signature. Yeah, I think um I think you're right about that. Hold on. About running 1060. Because it does feel smoother. At the beginning, it, it felt 30. Um, it felt like it was at 30, but now it's definitely running. It's running much smoother. Alright, so. So use the Panessa antenna to pinpoint the scarecrow's location. 
So where are we going? Over here? The giant green button? No, that's not it. Wrong button. Nah, see, yeah, it tells me, it tells me that's it. Remote switch. Yeah, I had a, I had an issue there as well. Let me know when you've reached the antenna, and I'll run a citywide scan for those radios. All right, I guess we're going out. Jim, we've got a way to find out where Crane's working from. Thank God. What can I do? Get your men ready. As soon as we've got a location, I'll let you know. All right. All right, so where are we heading to? Uh, hold RT, dive off ledge while running. All right, so are we good? There we go. We're running at this location. All right, hold on. Oh, so I have to hold down A. Hold on. Let's go. Let's go back up. Okay, let's run. Not what I wanted to do. <laughs> Not what I wanted to do. How far is that? It's 600 and some odd. Let's get that bat. We'll be over here. Let's go get. Let's go get me. There we go. I'm a bad driver. Oh shit. <laughs> Ooh, that drift. Too fast, too furious. So we are here. So we need to get in there. Let's go ahead. I guess we got to go through the front door. <laughs> All right, here we go. Hack it. Hack it, hacker man. So, <laughs> this is the part where I wasn't paying attention the first time I played this game. And, oh my god, it was so bad. Alright, let's get, let's get the, let's get our, let's get our Batmobile over here. Let's get our Batmobile over here. I need to stay within range of the remote control. Oh, where, where is he at? Oh, that's why. My bad. My bad. My bad, bats. I need to stay within range of the remote control. My bad. <laughs> Arcadia was good, man. Yeah, man. I haven't done Twitch in a minute, bro. All right. Hold on, hold on, hold on. How do I get out of here? How do I get out of here? Nope, that's not it. Can't change. Oh, exit remote. There we go. Okay, so let's go ahead and run this way. I think this is where I need to bring the car and then go up the yeah, this is where I need to get the car. Alright, so let's uh let's let's move up. Let's call the Batmobile. Boom. Okay, so this is where this is where it gets dumb. 
Man, this game was so much fun to play. Yeah, this game was awesome, man. Arcadi, you have do you have AT and T? Because if you have AT and T, you got a way to play this game. Again, even though I'm pretty sure you probably have a copy of it already. Ah, I'm out of coffee. All right, power winch. Pulls down obstacles and moves heavy obstacles or obstructions. Delivers high power AC electrical energy supply. This is the part I hate. Or I hated. Let's see if I can get it right this time. Okay, so we gotta go into battle mode. RB to power the winch. Pull this down. All right. Boom. There you go. Oh, <laughs> I missed. <laughs> I missed, I missed, I missed. Let's do that over again. Uh, <laughs> that was bad. That was bad. Did I make it? <laughs> um, Mr. Perfect, I believe it does. Um, When I looked at the... Uh, the menus earlier it does show all of the uh, all of the expansions. Yeah, see, you got all the expansion missions over here. Uh, I'm not sure if there were any more because I only had the base game of this, so I didn't have any of this. Um, and once I beat it, I was like, all right, I'm good. I'm I'm never playing this game again. All right, let's try that again. Oh my goodness, are you kidding me? <laughs> All right. There we go. There we go. All right, cool. <laughs> the part I hate is when you had to fight the three tanks at once plus one, one Arkham. Yes, yes. Very annoying. Look at your city. Abandoned and terror by those that fled. Torn apart. Tear it open. Alright, there we go. Give me a nice little ramp there. The other way, the other way. Oh my goodness, are you really stuck? Batman, are you really stuck? No, 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 no. Don't fall off. <laughs> I almost did, bro. There we go. I made it. I made it. This mission is so stupid. I hate this mission. Oh, we got that winch again? Oh, no. That was just a light. <laughs> this is so silly. All right, where else are we going? <laughs> All right, we're going across there. Oh, wait, 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 here we go. Okay, all right. Oh. I got to get closer, I guess. I'm trying not to mess it up. There we go. The anchor point is secured to the wall. I can't move it using the Batmobile, but maybe it can hold the car's weight. Okay, so I gotta go forward. <laughs> this is so silly. <laughs> 
Uh, all right, cool. Thank you. <laughs> I wanted to play the game and fight bad guys. <laughs> Not do stupid ass car missions. Okay, so uh, wait, let's move. Let's move the car over. God, I hate this. Okay, so shoot the wench. All right, there we go. There we go. They left in G four stuff. This was a quick and dirty port. This is a. I don't know if this is a G four port though. I mean, maybe it is. Maybe it is a PC PC port. Um, it, it plays really well. Um, it's been ported to Linux cause it's running off Stadia. Um, it's really nice. Um, but I don't have any history with the GeForce, uh, st stuff. So I believe you, <laughs> you can tell me pretty much anything. You can tell me this was a super Nintendo version uh, and I'd have to believe you cause I, w I wouldn't know any better. <laughs> Look at the settings and it's in there. All right, so where, where are we looking at? Yeah, just the mouse stuff, game pass setting or game pad settings. It knows I'm playing on an Xbox. I don't know, man. I wouldn't know any better. All right, so where are we going? Your cursor isn't in the game anymore. Ah, okay. We good? All right. Uh, use the antenna to Falcon Shipping Yard to locate Scarecrow. There we go. Graphics F. Graphics. Sh shout and charge him. Hold on, I'll look at it in a second. So, what, uh, under graphic options? Ah, look at that. <laughs> That's funny. So, it's locked. Okay, so as far as resolution, is locked at, at 1920 by 1080. It's at 60 frames, uh, texture resolution. I have it at high, shadow quality at normal, level of detail. Let's do high, because why not? Yeah, you're right. <laughs> All right, well, yes. to reach a vantage point to draw them outside all right so we're gonna go underneath if you drop fps can you change the resolution let's find out man that's what we're here for no oh duh no so no resolution you don't have an option at all to change it it's t it's locked at 1080 Whoa, let's see what that looks like. It's 
So we change it to 90. I don't see anything. <laughs> All right, so we're going to... Can I not go in that one? Oh, we just broke it. We just broke it. Yeah, it's it's I mean it, it gives you the option to 90, but it's not nah. It's this is not 90. This is still 60. Oh still I still need to uh, I still need to do more recon work on these guys. Okay, swing between vantage points. Okay. It's it's making me train. Something I wasn't really doing. If I can separate them, they'll be easier to take down. Uh oh. I gotta select the batarang. Damn, I don't remember any of this, man. I missed. I missed. <laughs> I mean, I threw it. Okay, so where am I throwing the battering at? All right, here we go. So let's go across here, see if we can take this guy out and then jump back up. Oh man, I messed up. Get the antenna. I should head back there before they do something they'll regret. No, I don't want to do that. All right, so RT is to crouch and silent takedown. What the hell? Oh, there we go. All right, so we got him gone. Where's the other guy? He's right in front of the building, I think. Alright. Where's he at? I thought he was up front. I lost him. Where'd he go? Oh, there he is. Okay, we'll get him from this side. Three more soldiers inside. They think they're safe if they stick together. Lucius, I've got a hostage situation. Three gunmen. I need to take them all out before they can react. Is it ready? Flexible plates over an MR fluid armor layer. Use detective mode, yeah. <laughs> I tried. Send it, Lucius. Now. Already airborne, Mr. Wayne. All right. So where are we going now? Uh oh. <laughs> like that didn't make any noise. That suit is tight. <laughs> I used to be in and out of detective mode. <laughs> yeah, this is dope, man. They did a good job on this. They did a really good job on this port. I'm shocked. Arcadio, I don't know if you heard the new like what's going on with this, but this is AT&T. They basically, uh, if you're an AT&T customer, you get to play this game on a browser, um, and then doing a little research, the shit's shit's running on Stadia. Mr. Wayne, let me walk you through it. 
on Stadia's white label. So Stadia's tech or Google Google Cloud Services. Oh man, 20 minutes over, we'll still play. Like Brown, <laughs> he's stupid man. <laughs> Hating ass hater. <laughs> we gotta play some um, Dead by Daylight man, and I know it's my fault that we never play. I understand it. And the fact that you're here, you just like I didn't hear anything that's going on. No, I don't want to do anything. I don't want to do anything of the such. I just want to fight. Three gunmen, one hostage. Time to put this suit to the test. Use the antenna uh, at the Falcon shipping yard to locate Scarecrow. Okay. Move in close to the group of three enemies without being detected. Use the fear takedown. Okay, so. I think we can go in the grates. Right, can I go down this one? Uh okay, okay. R T and B. The new suit is faster and more mobile. By getting close without being detected, I can get the jump on them and in the panic take down all three before they know what's hit them. Alright, so we're ready. Fear multi takedown in what? Bam. Let's go. Let's go. Let's rescue this guy. You were quick, but I never saw anyone take down three armed guys like that. Unbelievable. You're safe now. I'll send someone to pick you up. Thank you. Tell me you're going to find Scarecrow. That son of a bitch needs to be stopped. Yeah, he's going to find Scarecrow, all right. All right, so we got you safe. We went through the great uh let's go ahead and restart this. We'll take this guy back, back to the uh, police department. I've attached the uplink to the microwave tower. Perfect. I made an anonymous call to GCPD. They're gonna send someone to pick up the hostage. Come on, come on, connect. Love the suit, by the way. Okay, both towers are fully online. Time to find Scarecrow. Yeah, this is dope, man. He started a new DVD account. <laughs> so you're gonna get back into that? <laughs> Man, thank goodness that game is crossplay, bro. We'll play that everywhere. How does it look on PS5? I need to use both antennas to identify the micro and radio wave frequencies across Gotham. If I can find both frequencies at the same location, I know where Scarecrow is manufacturing his toxin. Okay, so where do we do? Oh, we're going this way. Uh, I mean, he's doing it everywhere. <laughs> what am I looking for? <laughs> See, this is what I get for not paying attention. There it is. The radio and microwave. There it is. Chemicals. The lady I met on Bumble is a gamer. She wanted me to play with her. Hey, do your thing, man. Jim, I traced the fear toxin to Ace Chemical. That's for real. Uh, I haven't played it on PS5. I was on my smaller TV, so I used a PS4. Okay, got you. Crane must have bought them off. Or worse. I'm in the area. I'll round up my guys and head over. Get rendezvous with Gordon at the Ace Chemical plant. Cross both paths. I did. I did. I did. I did. Thank you. I got it. <laughs> All right, how far are we going? 
Okay. Oh, that's a minute. All right. Let's uh let's get back onto the street. Uh, we'll call our Batmobile. We're gonna land, uh, and then call my Batmobile. Can't be doing all this flying crap. What are you doing? What are you doing? Uh, whatever, you guys can go away. <laughs> oh, I just hit that dude. You know, as much as I hate Bat Tank, like, it, it controls really well. Uh, it's just as stupid as the tank missions drive me crazy. You used to glide everywhere. <laughs> now nah, I'm flying, bro. Take it to the skies. I think there's a skeleton crew left in there, but they're not responding and the facility's locked down. If they're still alive, I'll find them. They should be able to tell us what's going on. Oh, it's 1024, yeah. So they did a good job. They did a really good job at whatever this is. The fact that it's free is great. Or the fact that it's free to AT&T customers is great. Yeah, those are serious words. Damn, he tried. <laughs> Damn near one third of the game. Seriously, man. Here we go. I'm gonna finish off with this with this last tank mission. Friend of yours? Stay here, and I'll go find out. He was like, oh, I'm just gonna walk in. All right, that's it. I think I'm calling it a night. So that is whatever um, ATT has decided uh, um, to, to to bless us with today out of nowhere, um, and that was pretty cool. I think it's I think it's a it's pretty good. I mean, it's believe it or not, it's running um, it's running very similar, if not better, to Stadia, um, and it is. I mean, it's Stadia pretty much. Um, but yeah, anyways. Everyone, thank you very much for hanging out with me tonight. This was really cool. It was a fun night. There's a lot of people in here. A lot of really, really cool people in here. Arcadio, thank you very much for chilling and not being too mean. <laughs> uh, my name is Aftendo. This is Dad Time Gaming on the Gaming Source Network, your number one source for all things gaming. If you did like this video, hit that like button. If you thought I sucked, hit that dislike button. It's all good. It's all love. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Um, if you want to see when we go live again, hit that notification button. Uh, and subscribe. It's free. I promise you. And you'll see our faces. Uh, with that being said, I'm out. Peace.